Ever since I was a little girl, life at the Ten Dreams trailer park had always been rather peaceful and pleasantly uneventful. Other than about half a dozen UFO sightings and that one time when they found a bunch of hookers from Little Rock buried in Jimmy Gibson's basement, nothing real exciting ever happened to any of us in Apple Springs. Real tragic what happened, but how could anyone have known? Stupid little brat! With the paper mill half a mile away, the whole town had smelled like a cabbage sewer for the past 50 years. Oh, fucker! Run! Run! All this was before I found that extra 50 cents in an empty pack of camel lights out of my good Sunday purse and chipped in on me and my girlfriend's weekly Arkansas Super Lotto ticket. <laughs> Even though we didn't win the big jackpot, five out of six proved to not be that bad. When life has got you down and you need some peace of mind There's a mobile home park out route four that'll start you feeling just fine When you're laid on rent living hand to mouth those four walls are closing in Bridge and lay away water bills to pay leaking through that roof of tin Through all them ups and downs just remember you've got friends a sisterhood of got your back that'll see you to the end trailer made trailer made you'll know you're right at home when your life is trailer made we all split the hundred grand four ways Tapioca was the one put it all on our heads to each get a little nip tuck with some of our winnings. Lower. She wanted number 12 on our ticket. Lower. The most number of consecutive orgasms she claimed to have had in a given night. You should know that Tappy doesn't know the term TMI. Lower, you stupid bitch. I've got to get me on this show. But that just seemed to be part of her charm. She'd been on every 12-step program known to man. S.A., N.A., Gamblers Anonymous, Shoplifters Anonymous, McDonald's Anonymous, and had decided being a quitter was the same thing as being a loser. Twelve was also the reason Tappy married Charlie. <laughs> Unfortunately, it had also been the number of months since her husband had that awful fall while out digging graves for the local cemetery. Oh, look, Charlie, your show's on. His parents fought the plug pulling in court for religious reasons and now had control over how much allowance Tappy got while she took care of him at home. Sad, really. They'd only been married a little less than a year, and he's been a complete vegetable ever since. I mean, nothing works. Not even down there. And for tapioca, that was definitely a deal breaker. Well, I got another package for you. Nothing sadder than a functional drunk slash nymphomaniac half widow who's lived a sexless marriage for over a year. I don't know how she does it. We all know the truth, though, of course. Oh, how many deliveries can I get on a Saturday? It had been common knowledge since junior high that the one thing Tapioca loved most after her friends and money was dick. But we loved her too much to call her a whore to her face. Yeah, I'd like to order a pizza. You do that with friends. She had delivered tonight. Believe it or not, we went to high school with Mamma. She's the reason we picked the number 25 as another one of our winning numbers. It became her lucky bingo number when she won the New Year's Eve coverall at First Baptist. It was also the number of years she'd put into Amway and Avon before going into business for herself last year trading coins. I'm not gonna have a delivery person come up in here till Thursday. So you won't go ahead and order now for like I've never weeks. seen her collection, but it must be a pretty lucrative business. Uh, I was always overhearing her on the uh, phone yeah, talking about quarters and good. dimes to her customers. Crystal's magic number was 18. Patsy! Mimi! Get on up in here and help me change these babies. Same as the age she'd been when she got married and had her first baby. Boys, get dressed! Waylon, get your mama's nightgown off. It's also the number of days out of the year she sees her husband, Cletus, who travels around as a professional carny and part-time rodeo clown. Luckily, she's got friends like us for free babysitting. 18 was also Chris's favorite channel, the HGTV. She's all the time coming up with crafty projects. God's eyes, TV, remote cozies, Santa Claus is made out of paper towel rolls, you name it. I think she'll always regret not going to community college for something like that. Crystal once said, I guess God had other plans for me. Kind of makes you wonder, though, what kind of plan God has for you once he's blessed you with 11 children and a husband who's never home. 
Nuh uh. I guess life can sometimes throw you a curveball, and Crystal? Well, she just never learned how to duck. <sighs> or how to remember to take her birth control. I think you're the next Martha Stewart? Are you constantly getting that creative bug? Oh my god! If you think you have what it takes to make you as a participant in HGTV's newest sensation, so you think you can hot glue, send the VHS tape of yourself to HGTV's. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do for this contest tryout, Mamma. I'm so nervous my postpartum pills ain't even helping. We just gotta plan you out the perfect audition tape. Are you seeing this? That's the third delivery she's had this week. Mamma, I love her and all, but she's just a downright whore. Now, now, now you know how you are with little Debbie Star Crunches. Well, I know, but... That is how Tappy is with cock. How I am with hydrocodone and how Mary Lou is with sales at the pay less. But we love each other regardless. Hold on. That's her whoreness now. Don't let her hear you say that. Say what, Mamma? Oh, nothing, nothing. Just don't mind me. I'm just talking to my cat. <laughs> so get your mail yet? No, but apparently you have. Waylon, for Christ's sake, get my good heels off. No, you can't wear them. My scooch. Girls, I think Waylon might end up, you know. <laughs> you got 11 of them. Just a law of averages, I guess. So I got a letter from Mary Lou. When? Today? Yep. And I'm guessing you two have the other two thirds. Meet me out on the patio as soon as you can. I'll be over there as soon as I get these kids out and get changed. Let me go get in my boob chair. 